We're looking for the blue thing. We at the gym again, hanging out with Sebastian right now, getting some stuff done, having some lunch, and yeah, getting some things done, like I said. So we got this rig section up here, um, looking pretty solid. I really like it up there, actually. It's gonna be sweet. Looks so empty down here, like what the heck. Um, but we're moving this section down, making room for the combo rack and the other three in one piece that's coming. And I'm actually gonna be switching. <laughs> so when we first installed the H-Stack, we put these two stacks, this one, this one, and this one on the wrong side. So now you're doing tricep extensions with this huge stack over here. And then you're doing everything else with the really lightweight. Um, not to mention this is a double pulley system. So I believe it's half the weight if I'm, if I'm doing my math right. Correct me if I'm wrong, math nerd, fellow math nerds. Um, versus a single pulley system here. So you get all the, all the direct weight. So anyway, switching the weight stacks, which is gonna be a pain in the butt, but it's gotta be done. Go. Oh, close. It was you, um, you, if you put the, um, you have to pick up, but if it shows the energy, you can use it on your protein. Where does it say on here? Does it say on here what energy you get to use? No, no. The white seems just mean your Pokemon can get. Get them? All right, let's see what other cards you have. Oh, more energy. Another energy. Ooh, this can block your attack. Oh, the your attack. cat? No, your attack. Oh, attack? Okay. Potion. <laughs> potion. Cool. The little business meeting. Uh, they normally do a beer and beer and business of Manassas, um, like a once a month. It was a once a month thing. They'd meet up at a brewery, have some beers, talk business. Um, but now that obviously this is all going down, we're doing. They're doing like a weekly thing on Zoom, so that's really cool. So I finally got to join, um, and meet some people, and gonna be doing it regular, doing it once a week. Um, really awesome way to get to know people in the area, um, get some help from fellow entrepreneurs, people who know what they're talking about, already got connected to another CPA, got connected to a payroll specialist, got connected to a, a tech company. So it's really cool to already like meet, connect, have connections and just build up the network overall. So looking forward to continuing that, building up the network, like I said. We had a interview with a freelance writer. She's been following us for a little while. She reached out to us wanting to do an article um, on us about the gym, about this, how we started our story, and then now how this whole thing has been affecting us lately. Um, and so we were super excited to do it, obviously. She was reached out to a bunch of different papers, trying to find someone to accept the, um, accept her proposal and the Washington Post actually decided to pick it up. So that's kind of wild. We have a pay, uh, an article potentially going in the Washington Post about us and the gym. So keep an eye out for that. We'll definitely keep you updated. But that was super exciting. Um, the feel like went really well. We got a got a cool story to tell. So I'm super excited for that to get uh, get published and shared around. So hopefully that kind of draws some, you know, draw some attention. You know, the more eyes on us, the better, right? Super pumped for this pickup. Got a quality commercial grade seated uh, bench. So great for shoulder press or overhead tricep work, any kind of seated dumbbell movements. So, um, or seated, you could do some uh, military press or whatever in the rack or rig. So pump for this thing, picked it up um, about 20 minutes away. Things really nice. I'm gonna probably paint it black and get some seat covering just to have it match the rest of our equipment since it's all black. Um, but yeah, really excited for this pickup. Couple updates. So checked our bank account for the business and because of you guys, we're, we were just so grateful, so thankful. Um, we're able to pay all our rent and utilities uh, for the next month um, without having to supplement any of our personal income, uh, not income, personal savings. Uh, so thank you guys so much. I mean, this is just huge that we're able to do this. Um, uh, yeah, so right now I'm going through and everyone who had froze in their accounts. What I basically did instead of just like putting a holding account, I just like credited a month. I'm just doing cre crediting a month at a time as, this, as we're going through this. So hopefully this is the last month we have to actually do this. So I had the beginning when everyone had frozen and just credited a month of um, membership basically to their accounts. Now I'm going back and renewing it because it's about been about a month, almost exactly a month, crazy. Um, and this all happened. So um, going back and crediting the next month uh, so that no one, so you don't get charged if you froze your account. Um, hopefully that all goes smoothly now. So we're just running through the software doing that. 
Uh, like I said, we're able to cover all our expenses though so far, so which is amazing. Again, we're not taking any money out of the bank. Or if anything, we'll be, we're putting money in, um, buying some new equipment um, and new stuff like that. So we're really excited for that. So thank you all again. So good. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Up, 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 up. Let's go. Finish strong, babe. Come on. Nice. It's wrapping things up there for the video. Um, yeah, it's been a productive week. Uh, I'm a little behind on the videos, so sorry about that. But got a lot done, especially yesterday. It was a really productive day picking up more equipment today. I'm super excited to show you some new pieces that we're putting in the gym. We're moving some stuff around at the gym tomorrow, uh, doing some layout stuff, um, doing some more upgrades and stuff at the gym. So yeah, I'm excited for everyone to see the gym once we're, once we're back up and running again. It's gonna be a whole bunch of new equipment and new, just like a new layout and um, really clean and just a refresh. Like I'm, I'm really excited for it. So I uh, can't wait to see everybody back there. Hopefully May 8th, um, we're back up and running, but you know, no guarantees, I guess, but that's the what we're kind of working off of now, May 8th. Um, trying to get all the equipment back before then, that it's, that's all leased out, uh, get it all cleaned up and organized and everything. Um, and they'll probably stick to that 10 person limit kind of thing. My thoughts were that we'll probably do that first week, members only, and then see how it goes. If we have space and capacity to take on guests and new members, we'd like to open it up to new people as well. Um, just because obviously, yeah, we want to be there for the community when this is a tough time for everybody. Um, but we also want to make sure that our members, uh, you know, have, have that priority as far as people who are, you know, uh, supporting us during this crazy time that they're able to get their workouts in and not have to, you know, if we're only having 10 people at a time, it's, it's kind of tough. So making sure we have capacity before we open it up to like new people and everything. But, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. We'll see you, uh, in the next video and uh, talk to you soon. Hope everyone's staying safe. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Peace.